How's it going today? I'm here at the Purden Conservation Area in Lanark Highlands, Ontario. And this is one of the first places I ever came to when I was starting my channel. Actually, I think it was the second place uh, that I came to. And when I was here last, the flowers were not in bloom. Uh, we have a colony of the showy lady slipper orchids. And uh, that's the reason why this place is one of the seven wonders of Lanark County. So without further ado, let's head on down the trail and check out the flowers. One nice thing about the Purden Conservation Area is that most of the trail here is on a boardwalk. And as we go along, we're going to see a bunch of these little information signs that tells us about the plants and wildlife that live in here. Okay, so here's an example of uh, one of our little information signs here about the mountain maple. Uh, this tree or shrub is locally abundant in swamps, fens, along streams, and in seepage areas from Newfoundland to southern Saskatchewan to North Carolina. Uh, the mountain maple has winged seeds that uh, persist on the plant well into winter and provide winter food for the evening grosbeak, purple finch, ruffed grouse, and also small mammals that are essential to the forest food chain. Okay, so here's a nice little example of the flower that we've come here to see today, the uh, Lady Slipper Orchid. They're beautiful flowers, and they only bloom uh, between June and July, so it's a very limited window uh, to come on out here and see them. So as we go along, we're going to try to uh, see if we can find more of these flowers along the way. They're scattered throughout this entire area, so keep your eyes open. The nice thing about this trail also is that it's a loop, uh, so we can go off one way and come around and come back to this exact spot here. And if you wish, you can even make a donation to help out the uh, conservation area. Ah, see, here we go. Here's a bunch of them. And uh, this sign here talks about the entire area here, the conservation area. Joe Purden, uh, the man who actually uh, started this whole conservation project, talks about uh, the stewardship of the wetland, nursing nature, future endeavors, the management of the area, and how you can adopt an orchid. So yeah, there's just a whole bunch of them just uh, on the side of the boardwalk here. Over 10,000 of them are growing in here. So 
So as you can see, they are a very beautiful and very unique looking type of flower. And they kind of do look like a, a slipper in, in a way. Okay, so now there's another way we can go. We can either go off to our right to complete the loop, or go on over this way for a second. And if we go up these stairs, there's actually a beautiful lookout of uh, Purden Lake. And there's also another trail that goes off this way. I won't be doing this one today. Uh, but I will come back and do it, the uh, Ted Mosquin Highland Trail. And so we can see here all the different names of people that have helped to donate uh, to the Purden Conservation Area here. All right, we're going to go up the uh, stairs here to the scenic lookout of Purden Lake. Let's go. So the lookout's just up this way here to our right. If we were to go left, there'd be a parking lot out that way. There's not much to see. The lookout's just over here. All right, and there's the beautiful view of Purden Lake. All right, so I'm going to head back down to the uh, boardwalk after seeing that really beautiful view of Purden Lake. Uh, so we're just going to go back down the stairs and I'll see you at the bottom. All right, come back down the stairs now here. Nice little areas here for uh, picnics. You could bring a picnic if you want. Just enjoy the beautiful scenery here in the conservation area. Okay, so we're gonna go off uh, to our left and continue the loop of the boardwalk and hopefully see some more beautiful orchids. Right here, actually.
Okay, so we're coming up to a nice little sign here that talks about the showy lady slippers orchid. So it's a, a large perennial orchid that grows in colonies. The Purden colony is probably the largest single colony in Canada, and it has been in existence for more than 50 years, spreading from the original dozen flowers to the thousands that are showcased here. So here's a fun fact, the uh, showy lady slipper orchid requires a wetland habitat and is often found in cedar, spruce, and tamarack bogs and fens, and this wetland is uh, classified as a fen. Uh, the fen within Purdon Conservation Area provides excellent soil, water, veget uh, vegetative and light conditions for this orchid, and the continued man management of Mississippi Valley Conservation, these conditions will be maintained. Lots of uh, really good information here. So you'll also notice that there are some pitcher plants in here that kind of look like this. Uh, this beautiful plant is carnivorous, flesh-eating, interesting, and it uses insects for food. The hollow leaves of the plant collect rainwater an insect digesting enzyme mixes with the accumulated water. Insects are attracted to the plant's leaves and are unable to escape because of smooth hairs at the opening. The pitcher plant flower uh, blooms from late spring to early summer on a stalk separate from the leaves. And there's actually a pitcher plant right there, that red one there. Man, I cannot get over how many orchids there are in here. They're just beautiful. Okay, so we've looped back around uh, to where we began, the boardwalk. So going on straight takes us back to the parking lot. And if you wanted to, you could go back this way and do it all again. Okay, so that is my trip to the Pruden Conservation Area out here in Lanark Highlands, Ontario. And uh, the, the orchids out here are just amazing. They're super rare. Uh, there's about 10,000 specimens out here that you can uh, come and take a look um, when they're bloom. Uh, so that's between the beginning of June 
and into mid-July depending on the, how things go. So come on down, check it out. Uh, I highly recommend it. It's one of the seven wonders of Lanark County uh, and I appreciate when you follow along. So please uh, like and subscribe if you want to see more of what I do. I appreciate it and I'll see you at the next one.